Hello! I am Fracture, and we are back on the SSN. Alright, let's see what's going on in here. This room? Nothing there. Calling me a waiter. Garçon, coffee! Garçon means boy. Alright, we've got a knitter in here, so I'm gonna- Oh, shit, I forgot to go to Oh well, you know, no big deal. We can- we can handle this. Bobo has got this. He has got this in the bag. Not outside of the bag, but in the bag. And for the sake of training, even though we are only 40 seconds into this video, I'm gonna go heal. I'll be right back. <laughs> Alright, we are back. And I think we just... Nope, we didn't beat this guy. Okay. There we go, we've got a Growlithe here. And we're gonna switch to... I guess Charmeleon will actually be pretty good here. With his dig. That Charmeleon with dig is just beastly. Uh, until he gets bitten to death. Then he is less beast less beastly. Alright, there we go. And I think Bobo started the level there. And again, <laughs> though we're 40 seconds into this recording, I'm gonna go heal. I'll be right back. Alright, we're back. And for the sake of my own sanity. I got a few super potions, so we should be ready to go for that. Basically the reason I'm healing so much is just because I don't want to sit here and- oh hey, a math potion. I don't want to not be training. Um, Charmeleon. Like I want him to actually get some experience from this. And Bulbasaur to go level 15, and he's just gonna destroy these water type Pokemon here. Unless they are a Tentacruel. Tentacruel. Then he will not destroy them, but Pikachu will. Alright. And now he's level 16 and Bulbasaur is evolving. No, 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 no. We don't want that. We do not want Bulbasaur to evolve. Bulbasaur needs to stay Bulbasaur. And for that sake, I am going to now freeze the game state just so that um, if Bulbasaur happens to evolve at some point, it doesn't have to. I don't have to reset the everything. All right, so let's do this. Let's do some more of this. Vine whipping, whipping them vines. So, oh, good lord! <laughs> so last episode, um, I talked about some work, a work-related story. But I think if you watch my channel, I'm going to end up talking a lot about my work. And I'll be right back. I'm just going to go heal up Bulbasaur. Anyway, as I was saying, um, if, if you are going to be watching me, then you will probably hear quite a bit about my work because I do it a lot. So yeah, that's where most of my stories might come from. Who knows? Anyway, the reason I say that is because I have another story from work. Bulbasaur, so you to level 17. And we're going to have to be careful again after this fight because Bulbasaur is going to grow another level. Alright, so. Um. No, 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 no. Anyway, so not only do I work at this um, bar area. Well, not even a bar. Not a bar. Not only do I work at this, like, grill area, but I also work as a, um, what's it called, a barista. I work as a barista, um, at the coffee shop that is connected to the grill area. So, um, oh, didn't know that would happen. Anyway, um, something that just pisses me off, and it, it happens with me and with multiple employees, one employee in particular, but, um, what happens is, like, if somebody's asking, like, oh, what kind of fruit do you have for smoothies? Um, we'll just say, like, oh, you know, we have strawberries, blueberries, bananas. And they'll be like, wait, so you don't have raspberries? 
And it always just like annoys me because it's it's like, well, if we had raspberries, I would have said that we had raspberries. No, like, I didn't say raspberries because we don't have raspberries. It's just, it seems like such a normal thing to say, you know, it's like, well, if I, if we had it, I would have, I would have said it, you know? Anyway, this happens just all the time, especially, like, when we're out, when we're completely out of ice cream, um, we'll be like, they'll be like, oh, what kind of ice cream do you have for shakes? They'll be like, uh, or we'll be like, oh, well, or, okay, <laughs> let me start that one over. We'll be like, oh, we're, sorry, we're out of ice cream for shakes, and they'll be like, wait, really? Even vanilla? We're just like, well, of course we're out of vanilla. Vanilla is, in fact, ice cream last time I checked, so unless you want some kind of not ice cream that is still vanilla, yes, we're out of vanilla. Anyway, I'm gonna go, y'all, be right back. <laughs> So anyway, as I was saying, people just like don't tend to trust you. Get, get out of my way. People just don't tend to trust you <laughs> for some reason. Like they're just like, oh no, no, no. You, whatever you say doesn't. No, it doesn't. No, no. I don't know why. Oh hey, it's just some relax. Anyway, um, but yeah, like, I, I don't, I don't get it. Like we say stuff, and they just it goes in one goes in one ear and right out the other. Just like, just like. H.E. Elephant said. They were right all along. Because it goes in one ear and right out the other. People talking something and you know you're something something. It goes in one ear right out the other. Yeah. I wasn't really a big fan of Cage the Elephant when they first... Sorry if my mouse just floated across the screen there. I wasn't really a big fan of Cage the Elephant. Like, it's not that I don't like them. I just don't, like, listen to them, you know? Like, oh, shit. <laughs> okay. <sighs> uh, yeah, I'll teach Bulbasaur Poison Powder. Oh, uh, growl. Get rid of growl. Um, but yeah, like, I don't know, KG Elephant is good, but I just don't, like, listen to them, you know? Ooh. Hoo -hoo. That. Bulbasaur almost evolved. No more room for items. Okay, well, I'm gonna teach, uh, what was it? Body Slam. I'm gonna teach Body Slam to Bulbasaur. In place of... Tackle. And I'm, I'm just gonna, just kind of a question. I'm gonna see, oh, everyone can learn rest. Dude. Thinking of my other... I might actually teach rest to Bulbasaur. I don't think I just don't think he has the like M Max either. I really don't think Bulbasaur has like the potential to be a good rester, you know? I don't know. Let's see who needs this. Oh, Bulbasaur definitely. Okay, and we'll give another one. Just because I don't feel like healing. So it's not right now. I'll heal later. Anyway, um, as I was saying, things going in one ear right out the other. But yeah, like, no matter what, without fail, it just seems like people just don't really trust the fact that we're, you know, making them drinks and stuff. It just, like, it annoys me. Just, it just, I don't get it. You know? I don't know. But anyway. Oop. I'm just gonna flip that over. I don't know. Um, yeah. So we're just gonna. Oh, that's a rare candy. I'm gonna use that on. Oh, I might as well use both of these. I think, actually, if you use a rare candy, it will. Yeah, there we go. He revives him from fainting, too. I'm gonna use both my rare candies on Charmeleon. Uh, and then I'm gonna use the Super Potion on him. There's your pro tip of the day. So, in case you're wondering, that's how that happens. And she has a Jigglypuff. I'm gonna go to Charmeleon. And fuck. Really? Okay, I can still use Dig. 
Ah, there we go. Charmeleon is gaining levels artificially. And I think basically we're just gonna let's see. Anyone else? Are these people gonna fight us? I know there are actually a couple more trainers in here that will fight us. Um, there's people out here. Got to chop. Um, ooh, that may have been a bad choice. <laughs> yeah. Okay, Pikachu, do your stuff. Oh, 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 oh. Alright, so. This episode might be going on a little longer. Didn't expect to spend this much time on the SSN. Basically, I just wanted to do as much of this in one video as I could. So. Sorry if I'm currently healing while talking. I didn't mean to do that. I meant to stop, but whatever. Oop, 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 oop. Oh, there we go. I should probably stop speeding up so much. It just kind of ruins the game, you know? I'll just walk. Just casually walk, you know? Because we're not... We're not really in a big rush. You know, we're just, we're just chill. We're chill. Let's see what's down here, because I don't remember. Oh, this is the thing. Uh, I, okay. Is there an item in any of these? Okay. I, there's a great ball. Okay. But, like, is, is there leftovers in one of these garbage cans, or is that in gold and silver? Because I always remember, oh, you look in the trash can to find a leftover. Well, obviously there's no leftovers in this game, because... You know, it's, there are no held items, but I don't know. I always remembered leftovers were found in the garbage can. Maybe that was what it must have been in gold and silver. All right, well we're gonna switch Charmeleon up in front because he's again going to be the number one person for our team. And here is Gary. Bone rash. All right, our fight with Gary is going to be in real time because he's kind of an important person apparently. I'm just realizing now that there's this little, right here, if you can see my mouse, there's like this little area. It's just, you know? I thought this fight was going to be in real time. That's what I said. But apparently, I didn't believe it. Uh, for Rattata, I'm going to go ahead and... I thought that was Eradicate. Right? Wasn't that Eradicate? So I remember reading about the, like, idea that when you f oh, damn. That is one of the top percentile of Rattata there. Anyway, I remember reading that, um, there was the idea that, um, when you, when you do that, Gary's Rattata actually dies, and then when you see him in the, um, when you see Gary again in Lavender Town, in Pokemon Tower, he's actually there moan mourning the death of his Rattata. But I thought it was Eradicate. It might be different because it's Pokemon Yellow. I don't know why it would be. It doesn't seem like... If anything, it would be harder, I don't know. So you give him Eradicate. I don't know. Bulbasaur is, Bulbasaur is growing to level 21. Bulbasaur is just... beasting through these levels here. Alright, we're going to use a nice strategy here of Poison Powder. Poison Powder. And then Leech Seed. Hurt by Poison. And then he's going to get Seeded. Going to jack off all over him. And I don't know why I did Leech Seed again. But he's going to lose health just so quickly from that. And that second leech seed is going to do a lot there. Anyway, so now we're going to vine whip, and this will just slowly dwindle him down. Poison powder leech seed is one of my favorite combos. And 393 experience, we defeated Gary, Humph, and I am raising my Pokemon indeed. Bulbasaur is evolving? No he's not. Stop evolving Bulbasaur, we don't need that. None of that. Alright, Cutmaster on board. Ooh, that doesn't sound pleasant. So, I'm gonna go ahead and rub this guy's back. Rub, rub, rub. And he is going to give- oh, I have no- really? I have no room for items. <sighs> okay, I have Pokeballs, Escape Rope. What's this? Water Gun. 
And no one can learn water gun. Uh, I think, okay, there's really no point in having this. Because, I don't know, it just, it's just, there's no point. Alright, so now we're going to rub his back again, it's going to give us cut, and that's how that's going to go. And we, oh, that's not what I want to take, there we go. Oh god. Alright. So, let's head back up here, and we will leave, I will leave you guys on this wonderful shot of the SSN leaving port. Goodbye! I always liked how right around here the water just kind of like it moves and then just stops and moves with the thing. If you understood what I'm saying, so like it moves with the boat, like the whole thing, the whole like level just kind of shifts over and then just stops. Anyway, this is where we're gonna end off this episode. Next time we will teach cut to someone, and yeah, see you guys next time.